Welcome. Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you. How are you feeling? I feel great. Yeah. Yes. You look incredible. You rocked it today. Who was Natalie pre Best of You? All over the place. Like, you know, I'm either all or nothing. Yeah. So I would diet like crazy and lose weight and then I'd be off it and then I'd gain weight. Yeah. And I didn't really know how to do it. I didn't have the knowledge of just how to be healthy and strong. Yeah. And, and learn how to manage my food and to exercise properly. Yeah. So you did come from an athletic background though. Yeah. You were a gymnast growing up, competitive gymnast. And then around what age did you stop? I stopped when I was probably 16 or 17. Yeah. And you went from tons of exercise and working out to nothing. Zero. Yeah. And at the time, our mothers weren't educated enough about women's bodies and hormones and to say, you know, hey, Natalie, you need to do something. Yeah. You know, like it wasn't like it wasn't even my mom. It was just like society. Didn't no really, society. But wasn't that's really into it. it was, no, yeah. it wasn't like, you know, you were in high school and when we were in high school, there wasn't F45s. No, there wasn't, true. you know, a workout on every block. It was either you went to the gym. Yeah. But somebody had to take you there. You know, it wasn't it wasn't a trend even. So you're yeah. right. So then you go off to school, you go off to university, you do grad school, you do your masters, you work, you go back to school. You're an accomplished lawyer now. During that time, what was your health routine? Before I got married, it was crazy weight watchers and all yeah. these different kinds of things. And then happily married and then you gain a bunch of weight and yeah. you realize, oh my God, I need to lose the weight again. So I was all over the place. Yeah, up and down. Um, and I would, you know, go through intense workout where I would do, you know, Bikram yoga every yeah. day. And then the hot yoga yeah, trend. So like, I just didn't have a, a system in yeah. place, any sort of structure. I just kind of did whatever worked for me. In my twenties and thirties, it worked. Uh, it worked. Yeah. Like I did, you know, no carbs. And for two weeks I would lose 10 pounds. Yeah. It was amazing. It was yeah. a quick fix. But then when I got into my forties, none of that worked. Nothing worked. Nothing worked. Nothing would And shift. if anything, our lives were calmer. Kids are older. Yeah. We don't have these babies running around anymore. We've got you know, grown kids, they go to school, you're working, it's COVID and you're trying everything. You're doing your Peloton. Food was what? Everything in my life was all or nothing. So a thousand calories a day, yeah. starve, or, you know, let's order KFC. Yes. <laughs> it was like one extreme or the next. That's I mean, that was COVID. I am. That's yeah. extremes. COVID, yeah. COVID is where I was having the sourdough bread every yes. day and all that. I got onto that trend and it quickly hit me that I yeah. gained. 15 pounds during 15 COVID. during COVID. And I got to a weight where I'd never been in oh, Okay. That's and scary. that was that was the trigger. Yes. I was like, I need to do something because if I don't do something now, it's just gonna get worse and worse. When you did find me, because I'm curious, were you hesitant to pull the trigger or were you like, no, I'm joining? I was scared. Yeah. Because I I I'm busy. Like yes. I, I work a lot of hours during the day. I work at night. I work on weekends. I have two busy kids with extracurricular activities. Yep. I didn't really know how I would fit this all in. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, but then I just I did the call, and he's like, "You're gonna sign up." I'm like, "Yeah, I'm gonna sign up. Let's do this." <laughs> and then that was it. And that was it. I had to be in. What would you say was the difference now this time? It's like you have a secret formula in terms of what works. And it's not one thing, it's everything. Yes. Knowing the right foods that can energize your body. I never mm -hmm. felt hungry, which I felt was amazing to me. That's amazing. Because um, you are, you're a grinder. Like yeah. you're on, and that, you can get super hungry right. when you're doing that. And when I'm stressed, I also get like emotional eating, like yeah. I used to do in the past, but I just felt like everything was balanced. Yeah, you felt satisfied. I felt completely satisfied. Strength training was great. You made it really easy to do the abs at home to do the walking during the summer was easy because I had a new dog as well. Oh, good. Yeah. Then the accountability, checking in with you. I was scared to check in with you if I had not been You're on You're a lawyer. Program. You could get yourself out of anything. <laughs> Why you? I know, but I've always you done could well in me. school. Right? Yes. Like, I need to get an A. I need to yeah. do well on this. I don't want the teacher to get mad at yeah. me. Yeah, so good. Kind of how I I'm glad I scare you. <laughs> um, and then the Facebook group and meeting people. I met great people. Yeah. So it was kind of just a combination of everything that worked 
and then you see the results and you keep going. Yes. Right? And so that's how it and all you, works. And you know, you have a beautiful story. You met somebody in the group as well. Yes. You guys start at the same time and you're both at the photo shoot now, yeah, we which is amazing. Yeah, you guys encourage each other and you really, you utilized the group for what it is, which is a support system. Yeah. So I'm, I'm super proud of the two of you for doing yeah. that. <laughs> you conquered it and you challenged yourself. What made you sign up for the photo shoot? I just wanted to have a goal. Good. Right? I yeah. just need like deadlines. You need it. Done. Yeah, I, I like need, deadlines. I need a goal and a deadline to work towards. Yes. And what's, then that, I saw... what's that law, the rule, you could get something done in the amount of time that you give yourself. Right. Exactly. So you could have said, oh, I'll just give myself, you know, a year or two to get to my 30, because 30 pounds is a big deal, 33. Yeah. Or give myself a deadline yeah. to get to it and you did That's it. my life. All yeah, it's all about deadlines. deadlines. I know, and when you're used to that life, you you, you like yeah, it. I, I like mean, it. that's why you're doing what you do. Yeah. yeah. What would you tell uh, the deadline girls at home? You definitely can do it. You don't think you have time, but mm -hmm. the busier you are, the more you'll fit things in. Like totally. the more productive you'll be. You plan ahead of time. You you plan when you're going to do your workouts. You prep on Sundays. Get the help from your support system that you have. To yeah. Make it all work. And Good. You could make it work if you really want to. Absolutely. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. You're a role model. So are you. Thank you. <laughs>